for eternity. I have watched my waves rise and fall with the waning of the moon. Over centuries, I have arched my back, contorted my entire being, twisting, straining, wading into the skies as the pangs of childhood overcome me, and I give and give as I have always given. The sea grass dances as crimson through my fingers, and the waves in their song of surrender. I once heard reference when you called my name. Samudra Matan, Sasma Arna, Goba. We understood each other, you and I. The fishermen would not always notice my shifting form as I soared beneath their tiny vessels, and as I gifted them my children, I breathed in their words of gratitude. From the abyss, I continue to push beings pulsing with life to the surface so that they too may witness the radiance of the sun. Love is life. But now, when I peer into your souls, I see the insatiable greed of cold fire hearts. You plunder me with no care. There is pride in your callousness. Your arrogance knows no bounds. You break our agreement time and time again, and now my patience is running out. Let me remind you who I am. I am the mother. I crush rocks and ships and mountains. I swallow cities. I spit out the bones of civilizations, and I will... I will remain gentle for a while longer. Because under the sludge, the stench, and the deafening roar, I still hear the faintest of whispers. Mumbari, Mumbet, Temana, Temana. There are still those who love. The air it calls to us in all its guises. Air is invisible, important, omnipresent. Air is nitrogen, oxygen, argon, carbon dioxide. Air is helium, krypton, hydrogen, xenon. The air it asks of us the following. No more breathing through filters to filter out man-made problems. No more smothering out the fire only to fear the smoke that follows. No more killing ourselves by killing our air, robbing the future. The air is everywhere if only we could see. Air of respiration, air of circulation, drawing breath. Air of anxiety, air of hope, breath of fresh air. The air is constantly shifting like the wind is a life force, like taker, like maker. We must learn to listen to air, to tree, the language of currents, read calligraphy in rustling on leaves. Air is lungs, air is love. Restored breath. Air is food. Air is pure. Our first friend in life. The air is speaking, calling to us with warning. Air is saying, You are suffocating in broken promises. Air is cautioning us. This planet is running out of time. We must learn to listen to elders. Pay heed to future generations crying in the streets. We must learn to listen to ourselves, our bodies, our hunger for the air. We must cleanse the air of what we've done while we still have time. We must take inspiration in our need for respiration. Learn once more how to draw in breath. We must remember what air has taught us. Air is invisible, important, omnipresent. Air is constantly shifting like the winds of change. Air is flowing, humping, healing breath of life.
the air it calls to us. Are you listening? Won't you help? I have watched my waves rise and fall with the waning of the moon. Over centuries, I have arched my back, contorted my entire being, twisting, straining, wailing to the skies with the pangs of childbirth overcome me, and I give and give as I have always given. 